Hi everyone, I am back with a new video. I wanted to share with you guys my planner pouch. So this is the pouch I bring with me when I'm planning around the house or outside, but I never really take my planner or plan outside the house unless I'm going to my parents or a family member's house for a while. But um, I got this pouch from Madewell um, if you sign up for their, um, their email list, you get, um, like a coupon on your birthday for $25. And I forgot how much this was, but, um, I ended up paying three or $4. I think I, I ordered something else. I think mask. So I paid like three or $4, um, for it, which I think is great because you get a pouch and you get three masks with it. Um, so I suggest you guys should sign up. So I really love this, um, pouch because it's see-through and I love the beige aesthetic. I do wish the, the hardware was more gold, but I, I really like it and it's nice and big. So let's get started. I'm not sure if you guys are like me, but I plan, um, like around the house. Like if my family's hanging out in the man room, I will take my planner stuff, my stickers, and um, plan downstairs, and my kids will be playing, my husband will be doing his own thing, so I carry this with me, or if I'm go we're going to go out, hang out in the bedroom, I'll bring this with me right before bed, I might have to like, you know, um, update my tracker or something, so this is what I carry with me. First, my AirPods. Like I said, if I'm um, planning, sometimes I like to listen to audiobooks or podcasts, or if I'm watching a movie and my husband is watching another movie, or my kids are playing and they're loud, so I always have my AirPods with me. Next is a tape runner. This is mostly um, what I use for journaling. I'll link this um, tape runner in... Um, in the in the description box this is a great deal it came with like i want to say six of these for like 10 bucks so it was such a great deal this is what i use when i journal like if i um wanted to put pictures on the page or like um a little i don't know card or whatever my next thing are my pens um so i put it in uh like a business card um holder I don't know where I got this, but um, I like keeping the pens like this because, you know, just in case I get, like, the ink. Um, I didn't want to put the ink on my pouch, so I just keep it like this. This is a black um, gel pen. I believe I got this from Paper Panda. And this is the Energel Klena in 0.4, and this is the Sarasa Dry in 0.5. So I have every nib, <laughs> nib size. The next thing is this freebie planner card from Hey Planner Girl. Um, if you don't follow her, you should. Um, her Instagram name is um, Hey Planner Girl, and she has a lot of beautiful freebies, um, journaling cards, dashboards, like inserts um she makes beautiful things so and she also has a shop on etsy which i'll link in the bottom so i carry this with me because it has the planner sizes and the uh, planner um insert resizing i love this because um when i make like dashboards for myself or as a freebie i can easily see what size i need and um if i was gonna reprint um an insert this is um, a great tool you know to see what size or percentage um, I should print it and so it's very handy the next thing is my tweezers so I just put this in a little um, I believe this was like an earring holder but um just a little tweezers I got at like TJ Maxx or something to, for sticker positioning. I don't usually use it, but sometimes if it's in a tricky spot, I will like use the tweezers. Next is my pink washi. I've been using this um, 
Well, I was using it because my kids had that vacation and remote learning and stuff like that. So this is what I used to um, like block a certain um, day uh, or week in my planner if my kids are off or they're um, remote learning or we have a vacation day or whatever. But um, so right now my I'm planning in like pink colors and stuff like that. So I'll switch it out if I was to do a nude or um, whatever color theme I'm in. But as you can tell, most of my stuff is pink right now because I'm planning in pink. This washi, by the way, I love because it's so skinny. And this is from Paper Panda. The next are my Crayola markers. I'm sure you've seen this in um, Instagram. This is the Colors of the World Crayola markers. So I'm just going to swatch it for you. Actually, this one is not. So I'll just swatch these for you. Uh, let me see. This is the Very Light Rose. These are the ones that I use the most. This is the Light Medium Almond. This is the Medium Almond. A little bit darker than the previous. And this is the Light Rose. Can you tell I have a favorite color? <laughs> The next highlighters are the Echo Line Brush Tip Markers. So I love these because the um, tips are brush and they're just so soft. Obviously there's the same color theme. This is the Pink Beige and the Pastel Rose. So I'll swatch these two. And this is the Pink Beige. And I'll write the info down below if you want to get one. I, I got these on sale, like buy one, get one, like half off or free or something like that. So I'll wait. I would wait for sale. Not that they're expensive, but it's always good to save money. <laughs> the next thing is this um, Raindrop Transparent Sticky Notes. Um, this is from Poi and Han, and I really love this. Um, I actually just used this um, this weekend to create um, my meeting and birthday um, page flags. And I'll show you that right now. So if you watch my flip, you'll know that right now I have two annuals or yearly overviews, which is one for like appointments and stuff, future appointments of the year. So what I did is used a flag and used um, a curved or arched um, script from Paper Panda and did a meeting and one for birthday. I thought it was so cute. So it sets it apart when you're, oh my, can you see that? So I have the other color here, but this one I did um, this weekend, which I thought was so cute. So that's why I have that in my bag. Um, the next thing is this freebie card from Cloth and Paper. Um, I like to keep the current month in my um, bag just in case I need it, like an instant look of what day it is. So that's that. I have a ruler from Paper Panda. I have, um, what do you call this? It's not coming up right now. It's, you know, exacto knife. There you go. To cut washies or whatever, you know. I have a uni pen, 0.3 or 3 oil-based ink marking pen. Um, obviously you need this for transparent page flags, so I will link this down below because a lot of people ask me about um, how I write in um, transparent um, page flags. And that is the only one that has worked um, perfectly for me. And then I have my Apple Pencil. Um, 
So when I make dashboards and stuff, sometimes I do calligraphy or I doodle with it. And I always have my um, iPad with me, so yeah. I have a correction tape. And how cute is this? It's a little white out in a shape of a cloud. I actually got this in a D stash, I believe. I believe. But um, it's cute. You always need correction tape. Even, you know, with everything, I always use a correction tape. I always make mistakes. Um, and then I got these scissors. You never know what you're going to cut up. Sometimes you cut up the pages or, um, you know, the inside of the ring page. Um, so I always have a scissors. These are, this is really cool because it's very compact. This is from Paper Panda. Then I have lotion. This is um, the Bath and Body Works Hyaluronic Acid Lotion. This is so good. But, um... I got this idea from Planet Girls Rock Aisha. Um, yeah, she said it was good, so I bought it, and it is good. <laughs> and I have a Tomball. And I cannot tell you what color this is, but I will swatch it for you. I believe this is the page one that everybody has. 942, I'm going to say. Yep. So, as you can tell, I have a theme with the colors. So that's all that's in my planner pouch. Um, let me know if you like this kind of videos and um, what do you guys have in your planner pouch or what kind of pouch are you carrying? Um, let me know if you also plan around the house with a bag and a tote with all your planner supplies and tell me I'm not the only one. <laughs> all right. Thank you for watching. Bye.